Hello, ladies and gentlemen. I am the Marmoset. And this is Shattered India in Crusader Kings 2. See? Very, 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 very shattered. What we are up to doing is creating a Buddhist kingdom. We're going to see how far we get for the year 1000. Several years in already, we've managed to get ourselves up to three provinces who are aggressively expanding. In the previous episode, our aggressive expansion went away. Uh, we need to keep an eye on our title loss on secession, so I don't know how many years we've actually reigned for. It doesn't actually tell you. If we click here, go history. So we inherited in 696. Ooh, excuse me just a sec. Gotta love spam phone calls, don't you? Um, 769. So 779 is all we've got to the years we need. We will be able to actually take control of said province. Right. Uh, with that in mind, we should probably think about aggressively expanding again. You have 670 troops. You've got 454. So you are the weaker one. So with you and that, that in mind, we will declare war on you. It's an aggressive war. Yet even more loss of prestige. My armies, to me! Everyone, gather here. You are immediately trying to attack that small group. I am just going to stand you down to avoid taking the hit. I would like to be leading the center. I would like you to be leading that flank. So, small sides, just enough. Sides, you're a little weak, but his morale is much lower. So let's let's just hold off a little bit. So he's decided to go over there to try and seize that province. The reason being, I suspect that because it's got the smallest amount of levy. So we will head to Lucknow and then avoid crossing the Ganges into here. So that morale. We're going to hit on the 19th. Our morale on this flank should be pretty good by then. So, let's see. Ooh! Knock the speed down a little bit. We have a look at the combat. Focus on war elephants. You gain the train. War elephant lever. Tactic use of war elephants. So we get morale damage. Plus 20%. War elephants. Plus 20%. Do we actually have war elephants? Uh, where do we find that out? There's my castle. Cavalry, heavy cavalry, special units. Don't apparently have war elephant pens. Mm. So I don't have the technology for it yet. Apparently I need castle walls too. I don't have any rank of castle walls yet, but apparently I can build elephant pens. Or I can master flat terrain, or I can master cavalry, or I can master light foot. Mostly, plains, 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 jungle. I kind of have to. Elephants. Elephants, yeah! So, we are going to crush that flank in the melee phase. Castle Town's been built, it's good to see. So that's flanks crushed. This one's also going to collapse. We've got the flanking bonus in the skirmish range here. So it's slightly closer than I thought it would have been. Oh, we might lose that one, we have indeed. We are, however, going to take their centre and go into a full set of pursuit. With the squishing and the crunching noises. So we. Ah, nice change in our previous war. We actually killed more than we. Uh, took casualties for. Now you are currently crossing the Ganges. I have no interest. Nope, there's no river crossing between those two there. I have no interest in crossing the Ganges with you. You are going to Capli. You will also go to Capli. They will pursue you, dear sir. Yep, you can charge into here and attack him. No river crossing. So yeah, obviously what, uh, we have an additional uh, objective. Rather than just you know as big a kingdom as possible, we need to make sure we have as many war elephants as we possibly can. Excellent. 
shown my true metal in battle. I am brave. Brave. Plus two martial skills, personal combat goes up, moral defense goes up. Last opinion goes up, same trait opinion goes up. And the Craven don't like us as much. Good. We are not Craven, we are a battle hero. Every time our personal martial score is up, the more troops we have. So we got another 15 points in the martial score. We have 600 troops to a defenders of 288. So I am happy to sit here and siege. Yes, you're going to Makuba. Let's um, pursue and crush his army once more. Just get a few more kills, just to make it just a little bit more smaller. Kill 21 at the loss of 3. Come back to here, squish it once more. You only want them to have just a little bit more morale, as otherwise they just go straight to the fleeing phase, and you just can't kill enough of them. And we'll sit here and run this siege act. Let's knock the time up. In the interim, let's have a look at our court. Not a lot of people in court. The tiger hunt didn't go so well. What are the. Uh, probably we need to wait until we're at peace. We're going to hold a Diwali festival. Yes, yeah, that peace. Holding Diwali feast. Not the prestige game. We'll need that. <laughs> because we would then need to be losing prestige. Are you actually able of sieging that? You are. That's disappointing. Um, I don't really want you to do that. So I'm going to relieve my siege and go and smash you in the face. Like so. Read the siege. Got a few more bit more war score. He is then fleeing back to his location. Whereas I will then kill him again. Get a little bit more war score. And resume my siege. Having made sure that he is no longer in a position where he can siege any of my stuff. So we can afford to lose 200 troops in this. Wish that was ticking up a little bit higher, but so be it. We're not taking any attrition. We are making money with our levy fully raised, which is good to see. Ah. Uh, has inherited the Dalmara Sway. Your courtier is Duid. Without heir. The our Chancellor. Interesting. Okay, so with that in mind We have demands too big. Four or three holdings. Oh. Okay. We might be running a slightly higher demands limit. Ah. However, once we've captured this we will have enough of the thing to form the duchy, which means we will be able to have vassals. So that should also include our designer. So we need to open council permission. So we need to reduce our demands limit. So our symbol was two fish apparently for this. That's all two fish. There we go. There's oh, that's a castle. Hmm. I might be keeping hold of that. But what we can do is go to find characters. I'd like to search my realm for any gender. I would not like them to be in prison. Don't really hear them married. I don't want them to be want well, to leave it any any religion. Uh, I would like them to be my religion. I'd like them to be my culture. I would like them to be an adult. Wait for the great holes. And I require Wow, you people are useless. Were you, master schemer? Well, apparently, there's someone. Well, that's me. That's my wife. Hmm. All. So, who of this lot? So you would accept an invitation to court, apparently. I'm about to capture you anyway. So I think what I'm probably going to do is I'm going to leave that position empty until I can complete this siege. Oh, children lacks a guardian. My son. Arrange education. I will be doing it. Why? Because I want the events. I want the events. Of interest. You over here. No. You apparently didn't last very long. What happened to you? 
I was looking in the right place. This is where that larger county ended up. Was it Dieu Duchies? Dasherion. Vidopius. That's interesting. There's. That's, no, that's the house. Or title. The history. I was convinced that there was definitely someone over here who had expanded largely enough. It's a. Uh, the ledger. High Chief, this mayor of Dalicia. Oh, right, you're there, you're above it, that's why I couldn't see you. So you've made yourself into a duke. And you are doing very well for yourself. Nice. Anyone else got any more? That's me. We've got a shake. Eight. We were down there in Basra with two provinces. Alright. Let's see how far we can get. Like I said, it starts becoming a bit too easy because no one's got any size. Levy size. Then we'll make this kind of a short exploratory campaign and series. Come on, I want to capture this. I've got council permissions I need to fill. Victory. And this is squishing at 10, so that should come down nice and quickly. I don't think it's meant to hurt me, but the chrism still stung harder than it should. An eye for an eye. Wrath. Turn the other cheek. Patient. Patient is amazing. Plus one to pretty much everything. And defense. Did I become patient? I did not become patient. I'm brave, but not patient. Come on, I'm aggressively expanding while we're doing this. I don't want negative prestige. Damn it. Outbreak of disease. Alright, we're up to 85. To battle! <laughs> Let's see if by hunting these guys down, we can get the extra war score we need. There's another 10. Hey, my wife is pregnant again. Yes, you can try and counter seize that, but I'm coming for you. This is the siege. 2.6. Just need two more prestige. Two more war score. Let's see if this quick little battle will give it to me. Come on, I want 100. Oh, I have been wounded. Is. Well, that's what you get from leading from the front. One point. Oh, I am so close. War score is capped. I need something else to occupy. Alright, well, let's return home. Fine. Let's just smash you up once more for my own amusement. And then return home. Yep, yeah, yeah, well, the war score doesn't count because, you know. Damn it. Alright, I am here. Military. Stand down, stand down, stand up. That's a nice big army. Let's uh, stand you down. And stand you down. And you, led by myself and my guy. Oh, I apparently have lost yet another commander. Really need to designate a regent. I don't want any of the people. You are a vassal. You are my friend. You are craven, so you are not leading combat. You've got moral defense. You are brave. These are guys to go this way and remove said people from here. We ought to take this uh, fet that this demand size basically means that I have a relationship penalty. Family. Uh, there we go. So I have a relationship penalty and I also suffer a 19% penalty and I will hit victory. Yep, that's that. Then I'm going to turf these guys off the top of this. And then we need to sit down and re-siege this. Crushing at 11. 
because of the outnumbering and my excellent martial skill. Bandits have raised the siege camp. Damn it. Hopefully, when this is finished, we should have enough money. I don't think we've got any near the the prestige, though. A son was born. I will, him I won't be named after. Um, yes, I will cancel the ambition to have a daughter. Mass wealth. Become exalted amongst men. Become king. Paragon of enlightenment. We are gaining karma at a reasonable rate. Yes, I will become a paragon of enlightenment. Watch, this time I'll have a daughter. And there we go. Finally! Off a piece. Yes. Absurd, absurd the title. Has ended. Right. Military. Stand down. We've got too many titles. The title has been created. Give you 200 prestige and cost me 191 gold. Well, I have exactly the amount of gold I need, so I will then create. Created the title, the Raj. Huzzah. Prestige equal claims, that's a much better way of going to war. We still have a problem with our demand size. Laws. We don't have radio obligations. Realm. Um... Ooh, I don't know how often we can change these. And I'd much rather change the succession than I would the centralization. All the U7. Alright, well we can certainly get rid of... Right, well now our realm has gone larger, we need to find a new... Nope. We need to find a new... Search the realm... Chancellor. Not that impressive. Okay. Courtier in Sambal, Ustani, or Buddhist. I can't invite you to court. I invite you to court? I would not like to. Really doesn't like me. Um, that's probably because I just kicked him out of his kingdom. Okay, fair enough. None of these people are remotely interested in coming to court. You're married, aren't you? Yeah. Married? No. Uh, ruler? No. Hmm. Yeah, but you're worse than the ones I've got. Alright, fine. Um, what we'll do in that case is we will go to this castle and we will create a new vassal. There we go. And that person was this person. You're quite the good commander. I'm probably going to leave you in the field, actually. Minor titles. Ooh, extra commanders are indeed available, including you. And... You're just a vassal, but you have no modifiers. You are just a vassal, and you have a... You're a brave, so... Welcome aboard. Positions. Appoint a chancellor. I'd like you to improve different relations with the people in Asni. Thank you very much. Prestige claims. Yes. Minor title. Doesn't it, Regent? Demands too big. I know. Title on succession. Yes. What I'm going to be doing is basically waiting and suck up the uh, slight demands problem. Look, prestige. Happy days. Still decay because I aggressive ex expanded aggressively, but it should go away soon enough. Wounded. Mm, it's not good. But I do not have enough cash to hold a feast. How much money do I need to hold a feast? Present debutant Diwali feast. I need ten gold. Month is at least October. Oh, well, that one we can wait for. As the whispers whisper in our background. Cool. Every time my son Apno meets a stranger, looks like he might faint. A bit shy. Or oh, my air. Shyness can be surged. Terrible cause. I'll talk to him. Nothing happened. Drat. Well, at least he's no longer shy. 
Old wound is healed. Scarred. A little bit of monthly prestige. Aggressively expanded wears off in a year. And soon it should be October. The White Tiger. Rumors and peasants sighted. White Tower. I must send people out to find it. Yes, we must. And once we've done that, we'll do the Diwali feast. Well, we can do both at the same time, I suspect. It's October. Push. Fight all your vassals. It'll be a grand feast. Ooh. Gift to your spouse. Jeweled necklace. Small perfume box. Do without gifts. A jeweled necklace for my wife. Welcome all to my colourful, colourful castle. Snake Charmer. Fascinating. Works in magic. Suddenly you hear a shriek. Looks confused. Seems a large cobra is broken free. Slithering off the horse across to your guests. Oh no! A escaped over the table. It's half to death. The snake then quickly disappears. Not hiring a snake charmer again. <laughs> Traditional gifts. Wife is overjoyed with a magnificent gift. Thirty percent chance she will fall in love with us. My wife is ill and stressed and shy. Court poets, grateful. Darkest night Diwali is here. Important night: candles and lamps. Which rich and sweet food. Let us celebrate. Gain 30 karma. Fantastic feast. Do this again next year. Oh, that turned out alright. At least the snake didn't kill. I was hoping there would be some kind of event with the snake where we'll maybe have the option to, uh, you know, kill it and demonstrate our bravery and our martial prowess. So, thank you very much for watching so far. This with our, ne our next bit of the Shattered India campaign, we are slowly but surely going to rebuild India. It might get to the point where it's getting a little easier. I don't see anybody making much of an attempt to grow yet. Um, just to wait and see. We've got... There's a duchy over here. I don't think there are actually any other dukes about. Um, find characters. No, not that one. No, neither title nor region. Well, search all. Um, in prison, married, ruler. Any... Any... Any adults married? Any? Any? Both? Any? And if we go by rank. Huh, interesting. So we have a Pope, and then a Patriarch, a Satrap, Grand Mayor of Genoa, Coptic Pope, and then the Various captains of ducal rank. So there are, as far as I can tell, one, two, three dukes about. The Duke of Fars doesn't actually control Fars, the other duchies, but does control enough that he's be able to make himself into a duke. Ooh, and apparently we've got El Hassa as well. well. Still just a low level shake. We don't actually control anything, but yeah, alright, so there are some people beginning to make an effort to grow. No one in India has moved around yet. There's just me stuck on the little top, but anyway, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe next time. Dijour Wars! Just kind of make ourselves a little bit larger. Bye for now.